What's up, friends of the good boy? This is Money, and welcome to the next part in The Last of Us. It starts off with him scratching his head and Ellie talking something about plane dreams that she had. So, let's go further. Towards the hospital, this is where we hope to find certain kinds of doctors and scientists and people. Look at that. Another city. Another abandoned quarantine zone. Oh, yeah. And burn down cars and buses. There's that hospital the Firefly mentioned. Come on, kiddo. Right, the guy that we listened to, right? This is definitely the moment where, where um, I mean, already last time before we switched sequences in the last episode at the end, is really where, where Joel starts to understand how much um, Ellie means to to him now and how much she replaces Maybe we cut through here, huh? Maybe replaces is the wrong word, but how you know how how much she reminds me of him of Sarah and his daughter that died and you know like at this point he'd give everything. He get he'd give his life s in immediately to protect Ellie from harm. He's sitting there. Everything all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, you just kind of seem extra quiet today. Oh, sorry. No, it's not. Maybe it's her birthday. <laughs> it's fine. Huh? Oh, there's a ladder, look. Well, we could use that ladder. You're coming? Here we go. <laughs> She's not even there. Ellie? Ellie? What? A ladder. Come on. Right. She seems very distracted right now. I don't know why been three months since the whole thing happened to her I think last time with David right so I don't think you get over this very quickly what she had to do in the end but the birds whistling in the background man this is such a nice nice moment oh my god oh. what, what is the it? heck she's running off ellie ellie what is happening what does she see you gotta see this what is it what's that what's going on what the hell is what There's a, a, a giraffe, I think. Right? Yeah, look, there, she, there it Come is. Come on, hurry up. Running away, though. Or walking away, rather. <coughs> oh, wow. You see that? Slow down, kiddo. Come on. She's so excited she's never been so close to such a large come on, come on, come on. Look how excited she is. Imagine how much of a joy you could give her by bringing her to the zoo. This would be like 
oh, the biggest yeah. day in her life. Wow. Same as this moment here. And she's finally waking up. She's, she's finally ready. To, she's talking again. So, is this everything you were hoping for? got its ups and downs, but you can't deny the view, though. Oh, no. That is... Man, this is such a nice moment, right? This game throws so much bad stuff at you, so much frightening and violence and then it it gives you these moments where you're like wow it's like it's all worth it it was all worth it for this moment you know for this moment everything we've been going through it's been worth it man and the music that all together this is the mountain in the back this is just to do. We've got to get you somewhere. Back to the sad life. We don't have to do this. You know that, right? <sighs> What's the other option? Go back to Tommy's. Just be done with this whole damn thing. After all we've been through. Everything that I've done. It can't be for nothing. Joel was offering her a way out where... This is the end of the life. This is, this is everything now. Just living in peace for the rest of the life. And that's it. No more... No more stories about saving the world and I know whatever. You know. But there's no halfway with this. Once we're done, we'll go wherever you want. Okay? Well, I ain't leaving without you. So let's go wrap this up. Oh, okay. Over to the hospital then. That looks a lot like... This place takes me back. How yeah, so? me too. It was right after everything went down. I ended up in a triage just like this. And everywhere you looked, you just... saw families torn apart. Whole damn world seemed to have turned upside down in a blink. Is that after you lost Sarah? Yes, it was. I... can't imagine losing someone you love like that. Losing everything that you know. I'm sorry, Joel. That's okay, Ellie. He's filled a spot in his heart. She's filled that spot really well. You can tell, man, it's almost... It's kind of beautiful and sad at the same time. Alright, let's loot some more. I know I need desperately need more uh, parts with scissors because I've never actually in upgraded one of our melee weapons. Oh, tools! Wow, level five tools finally. Cool. I think we are actually nearing towards the end of the game now. And although I said in the beginning of this play session, which you know is many parts. Ooh, hello ammo. Uh, many parts of playing is what I do here, but uh, we're coming closer to a part where um, I think it's no longer taking forever. Pills even, look. And now I can go maximum health a little bit higher. Cool. 
Yeah, we got some more max health. And if we find a workbench, then we can upgrade um, things higher. Circle over. This looks a lot like before the university or the science lab last time. The tents that were around that. I think this is actually a workbench here. Nice ammo, pistol, map. Uh, of Salt Lake City quarantine zone. I wonder if Salt, Le Salt Lake City also has this mountain next to it, right? That would be something I'd like to check out. How many parts right, do we see have? What we got. 91. We have very few parts only. Armor piercing would be very important. Armor piercing on the rifle. I'm going to take the rifle. More important to me. Power. Round is fired by the weapon deal more damage. That would be useful, but we haven't even used the flamethrower all this much, right? And now we don't have enough to, do. to keep upgrading. All right, so let's search the rest of these tents and then see if we go in. There's a bus. Hey, Joel, I got something for you. Really? What Here. Maria showed this to me and I, uh, <laughs> I stole it. Oh, as usual. I hope you don't mind. What is it? Oh, it's the photograph with Sarah and Joel. It's the one that Tommy had for him and he rejected it last time. Zoom in. Oh man. I wonder how this must feel for, for Joel. <laughs> well, no matter how hard you try, I guess you can't escape your past. Thank you. Wow, she kept this for him. She didn't show it to him earlier because she knew it wasn't the right time, but now she's... I think now this is the moment. Um, where you can... can look at it. Because someone, someone, you know, she, she filled, as I said, she filled that part. Um, and maybe that helps. Where do we continue, by the way? Here? No, this, we've already been here, okay. Uh, we won't jump over the fence. I, <laughs> I'm not sure where to go right now. Maybe this way, huh? Through this? No. <laughs> what the heck? Ah, maybe through the crack? Or is this where we came from? I'm not sure if this is where we came from or not. Yo, no, this is where we came from, okay. Dude, uh... Where to continue? With on horseback we could jump over the uh, the barbed wire stuff. Maybe up here. This could be it. And then walking through this this thing up there. Maybe that is it. Or no, I think this is where the the giraffe was recently, right? No, that can't be. Maybe we have to step through the bus. Maybe I didn't see something right. Hold on. Yeah, okay, we climbed through this. Okay. Huh? Ah, down the tunnel. Come on, Ellie. He's coming.
Good moment to reload that rifle, too. This time it's gonna be different. I just know it. What do you mean? They're gonna be there. The fireflies. I'm sure of it. Hope so. Oh, El Diablo. We haven't used that either. We have a lot of ammo, man. We can't really go into a big shootout now. Are we gonna climb over this, huh? Okay. Seems clear so far. <coughs> right. I hear. Oh, okay. Oh, there's even a bloater. You know what? I have a lot, a lot of ammo. I'm not gonna mess around this time. I'm gonna kill everyone. Let's make that. didn't kill him. Yep, that did oh, though. Man. Yeah, come on over here, friend. Come on over here. I'm gonna take you all down. Come on, I'll get you. Shotgun time. And flamethrower. That's right. Come on. Come on, all you guys. I'm going to take you all out. Here we go. What have I been saving all this ammo for if it's not for this moment? To have Stay on my ass. <laughs> he dropped something. He dropped flamethrower ammo. Wow. I've just killed. Stay down, she repeats. <laughs> All right, man. Oh, we just went through so many of them. Let's reload. We still have a lot of ammo, dude. We can now absolutely annihilate. We have to no longer have to run away from battles. We have the ammo to deal with them. Uh, wait, should I craft this or this? Maybe I should improve. I want to see what happens when I do. I've never done this. So, the hatchet has now three instant kill strikes. And then it has two more because itself has uh, instant kills. So, that's cool. I hear more. Messing. <laughs> this is good. Finally taking them down. Does my melee weapon. Wait, I just used three one hit kill things on the melee weapon? That can't be. I still hear another clicker. Maybe it's time to swap. For the big shotgun. Oh my god. There's so many of them. That's good. I want many of them. Bam. And gone with that head. That's right. 
Are we doing the Manny Town? <laughs> That's right. So cool. I enjoyed this. Now finally playing with ammo. I wish you, the game would allow you this. I allow you to play like this more often. <laughs> yep. Reloading. No more sneaking through. Oh, two bloaters. me dude that is crazy man this is good this is fun this is really awesome all right so uh let's make this thing because we need that against it's definitely more useful than the freaking one hit blades yeah this is the best weapon we have here What? It wasn't reloaded, damn it. Come on. Boom! That's right, that's what we do it. That's how we do it in the Manny Town. You know that. You know that so well. Reloading. And we can reload also the revolver again. Oh, nice. More ammo for the other revolver. Somehow I feel like if you're using ammo more, the game also gives you a little bit more ammo in return. Let's use that flamethrower against these guys who are coming from here. Oh my god. There's so many of them. Burn, baby. Ah, that's right. You done. Okay, now let's take care of the rest. What? Is there more? Yep, there was more. Now, let's reload that flamethrower. We have two bloaters to kill. Did I reload? Yeah, okay. Now, we have a firebomb. We don't have a Molotov cocktail, unfortunately. So we can't... But we can make them burn with this stuff. Stay back. Okay. Get some distance. the brick over there throwing that
intense. Oh, got you, dude. Got another bloater. And I'm getting fire. And more fire. And ammo for this. We killed him. I think we got all of them. I think so too, and look how much ammo Endurance they're giving me back. Endurance or I? I've burned them all down to the ground here, man. They were all in one place, and I... With a flamethrower right through them. Super awesome. Filling up that shotgun. This shotgun is probably the best thing I have, man. This is so powerful. And the flamethrower also got more ammo. We also have seven arrows. Let's check out this room on the side. There's probably some loot for us. Swap this to the other pistol. Ah, well, there's really more ammo. Let's see what we can find here. You can definitely, most people will probably do this part quietly, sneak through. But not me, man. <laughs> no. No way I'm sneaking through this and leave all this goodness behind. So much fun, so much killing. So much violence. Is this ammo? There is actually a lot of good stuff here, man. Wow. The El Diablo has gotten more ammo too. Right? Pretty good so far. Let's see what's going through this. Is this a shift door maybe? No, it's closed. Okay. The other way around then. Ellie, come on. It's so good when this game allows you to just go in rampage mode, right? Just kill them all. The last of us. We kill them all. Boom. And I was even able to kill that bloater. Um, uh, two bloaters, even. Without a firebomb. I just grilled them with a flamethrower, and then I uh, hit them hard. I think you can shove that crate down? And if you do this all quietly, you have to get to this part and stay quiet with doing this over here, right? So... Okay. Look out below! Okay, this is pretty loud. Okay. Oh, water. So I gotta find a pallet for you again, Ellie. I think I already see it. No, that's not a pallet. Um. Okay. I don't see it. Where is it? Diving? Oh, she can walk here. No, but never mind. She can walk this entire path until this point. What? Watch your step. That water looks pretty deep. Okay, now. Hey, that's what we can do once we're done. What's that? You can teach me how to swim. You got it. That sounds like a useful thing. Um, I guess I'm gonna have to somehow open the way, huh? Ah, okay, I swim through this here. Oh, come on, Joel, swim. You can do it. I'm on the other side. Hey, right, hold up. What ladder? Where's a ladder? Ah, there. Isn't it great that there's always a way further? <laughs> so let's go and drop this for her. Look out below. Okay. So while she's climbing up, I'm gonna end this video episode right here. I think we're getting closer and closer to the position, to the point right, where- Alright, stick to the edge. It's shallow over there. Uh, where Ellie is, we're gonna basically give Ellie over to uh, some people to find out what's happening with her blood and how she is immune, right? Oh, free 
freezing. <laughs> yeah. All right, so that will do in the next episode, hopefully, or in the one after. I don't know how much there is still in between. So thanks for watching. Have a good one, and I'll till then. Bye-bye.